talk.com. Hi, and we are back. I am Regina McKinney McGee, and we are here with Central Valley Talk.com. And look to my right and to my left. Introspection time! Woo! Now, let's find out what's going on. Who do I have to my right here? My name is Sylvia Van. And Sylvia, what have you been doing with introspection? I'm one of the editors, and I'm telling everybody about it. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Now, to my left. Hi, I'm Sarah Mejia. I'm the editor of Introspection, an awesome must-read. Isn't that the truth? Hey, holla! Hi. Now, who do we have to the far left? This is so exciting. I am just so excited! Hey! Hi. I am excited, too, and I am Glow Sales, and I am one of the characters in the upcoming audio book. And it's gonna be off the hook! Holla! Holla! Now, this is gonna be so much fun. Okay, let's, let's see. What has Gina been up to? Where are you at in the book? What chapter are you? Actually, I have completed the book. I'm showing the book to co-workers. I gave the book recently to a friend for her birthday just today. Oh, at work. you go, She girl. was talking about that book. Oh, what did she say? She is frustrated. Why? Because she wants to know what Gina's up to next. <laughs> I can't tell that. That's the second. Oh, so she finished it. That oh, she fast? finished the book. She was telling co-workers about the book. Oh, awesome. So much that another co-worker gave me money today to get the book. <laughs> awesome. So I told her I'd have you autograph the book. Oh, I would love to. I would love to. It's a quick read, huh? It is. And I'm not, myself, I'll have to admit, I'm not an avid reader. Uh -huh. However, that book I could not stop reading that well book. let me ask you a question since you read it uh, what is what what was it the favorite part in the book that you, you you what what got you okay what got me about the book was the old schoolness of it oh it took me back uh -huh. as young as I am and as young as I am too <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you guys I am 25 turned backwards and I just did that April 11th I'm not ashamed to tell my age I am 25 turned backwards figure that one out but okay. I love the some of the references to the old songs mm -hmm. I liked um, now I'm from back east and um, a lot of um, References in the book to playing in the snow. Oh, yes. I like that, making angels, angels in the yes, snow. Yes, yes. So I really related to that. About Mama's cooking. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, we mm -hmm. had to get Mama's cooking in there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we had to do that. We had to get Mama's cooking, oh, yeah. That was, that was so, good. And Collard the fact greens, black-eyed peas, chicken. Oh, yeah. Chicken, yeah. Yes. Oh, yeah. Pie, pie cherry, cherry pie, apple, pie, apple <laughs> pie. Mm, <laughs> making me hungry now, you guys. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. And, and um, I was... Um, I was interested in Gina's fetish. Should we tell her oh, Gina's fetish? Yes, you oh, might as well. I wish I had one right now. I, I guess I'll just take a sip of this water. <laughs> so so you shouldn't have me down the street. Oh, Lord. Uh-oh. We can't, we can't say that because you know what? I may be out here and go get me one. What is it? Slurpee time! <laughs> Slurpee time! For those of you who have never had a Slurpee, let me tell you. It is good, and for those of you, I don't know, we probably can't get it in here, but on, on the cover of the book is a Slurpee. Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola Slurpee. <laughs> Cola. Oh, yes, but you know what? The, the flavor I really like, and, and, and I can't really find it too much, but the root beer and the banana. You mix them things together, oh, it is off the hook. From the old school, you remember those pops, and they were banana pops and root beer? Oh, to die for. Yeah, Gina has a fetish. She has an obsession with Slurpees. Yes, she does. If you read the book, she'll tell you why. Oh, yeah. Have you tried a Slurpee yet? Oh, yes. What's your favorite? I'm liking Pina Colada. Ooh. What about you? Mm -hmm. I think I like the, the root beer. The root beer. How about you, Sylvia? I like the Coca-Cola. 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 You're trying to be like Gina, huh? Oh, yes. Now, what else in the book? Tell me something else about it that you like. 
you know, I like the her family. The uh -huh. whole family. You, you know what? Her family really came together. Yes. Mm -hmm. I yes. mean, there were areas in that book to where Gina needed to be protected, and she got some yes. straight up protection. Yes, she did. Didn't yes, she? she did. Yes, I mean, she did. She had she had brothers that uh, loved her. You could feel the love in her family. However, with all the love that Gina got. She still had a lot of pain. A lot of pain. She had a, a lot, lot of pain, pain. Yeah. which many of us do. We we have a lot of pain that we don't. We we mask it. Right. And, and Gina was a masker. She still mm -hmm. is. She she's a masker. So I am still in. Uh, me too. Like my coworker, I'm frustrated because I want to see what's behind that mask. Because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. she's wearing. I a am mask. so sorry. I did that to you guys. <laughs> I'm sorry. And if you guys want to be having withdrawals and get frustrated at me, it's okay. That means you've read my book. <laughs> Isn't that good? What about you, Sarah? What part did you like? Well, I can't stop thinking about Clyde. Oh, she's hooked on Clyde. <laughs> if you exist, Clyde, give me a call. <laughs> <laughs> or go to introspectionnovels.com. <laughs> what is it about Clyde that you like? He is a smooth man, and he is good to Gina. Isn't he, He's though? not a dog. He's not rude. He's very, very respectful. What Tall, women dark, want. and handsome. Isn't that the truth? Mm. Mm. Olympic swimmer. Mm. Salt and pepper hair girls. Holla. And he's single. <laughs> <laughs> but it's in the book. You gotta read the book. But what are some of the things that Clyde and Gina do? Let's let's tell the the viewers what are some of the things they do. They drive. Drive each other crazy. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I like that. Don't want to give that away. That no, we can't weird. tell that. We can't tell what they do because then you know what? What's the fun of it? We gotta leave a little bit of suspense out there, don't we? They have really cute relationships. Yes, yes the two do. of them go to the beach, and I believe they slap some boats. Dominoes. Domino's. Dominoes. Hey, 15, 20, 30. On the sand. On the sand. Okay. Talking smack the whole time to each other. Well, let me ask you a question. What about the music? Mm -hmm. How do you guys like the music? Because for those viewers, we're working on an audio book. And what I've done is brought the, uh, the book to life through music. And you can, you can mm -hmm. feel it. And as we do the audio book, once it comes out, I mean the audio movie, once it comes out, you'll be able to really feel the life of it and the songs and everything. Uh, what do you guys think about that? How, do, how did you guys feel when you guys were going through it and you were seeing the songs? I know you mentioned the old school, but... Mm -hmm. she, Gina has quite a library. Doesn't Clyde she went doesn't. to her house and they went through some music, everything from the 40s. Well, I can't to tell the, the age, but you guys will have to tune in to see that one because then I'll be telling my age. Oh, I already told my age, 25 yes, turn back. Yes, I did. What about you, Sylvia? What part did you like? My favorite part is her relationship with her niece who has special needs. Oh, okay. And so cause oh. special needs is my heart. And yeah. so just you have to just read it because it's going to blow you away. And if you're a special needs parent like I am, you're gonna love Gina. Well, She's tell us, tell be. us uh, uh, about about your 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 special needs, what you're going through with that, and how how it is, and how it's how you're 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 dealing with it, and how the story impacted you. I have two sons with special needs. Um, my oldest, I adopted him as an infant, mm -hmm. and he had fetal alcohol syndrome. He was born with heroin, cocaine in his system. Oh. He had two strokes at birth, oh. and one side of his brain is working. But right now, he has his own apartment, Amen. and he works at KFC, and I think about making him a manager. All right, so all right. He's doing very Let's say holla! 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 That is good. And my second son. He's 15 and he has severe autism. Oh, okay. And I just had an IAP with him, and they said that he is doing excellent, and other kids in the classroom follow him. He's a leader. That's a holler! 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 Yes. So, um, just reading about this in this book, it brought tears to my eyes because it is so positive, and you made it such a positive experience to give special needs parents hope. And oh, I thank hi. you for that. Thank you. Thank you. See, <laughs> you don't know which way this book is going to go. There's there's so many char characters in it that are coming to life. And, you know, without telling everything, because it's uh, 8 to 12 books, 
each character has a life of its own. You're going to either love the characters or you're going to hate them. Now, I know I got a feedback um, about one of the characters that they, they somebody really wasn't too crazy about. That's the incident in Paris without us going through it. I can say it happened in Paris. What do you, without saying what it is, because we don't want to give it away, what did you guys think about that in Paris with the, the individual he's talking about? What he liked and what he didn't like. He was a dog. A dog. D O G. Capital D O G. Oh. Or would we say a a a dat? He was a dog and a cat put together. Oh, uh uh. Uh uh. He was all over the place, uh -uh. huh? He was nothing nice. But you know what? <laughs> Gina took care of <laughs> Gina That's all I can she, say. I'm not going to say anything else. Gina justice did. prevails. Justice prevails. But we shouldn't glory in Gina's, what, hidden secrets? Secrets. secrets. She has a lot of secrets. Secrets. A lot of secrets. Mm -hmm. Well, you know what? I want to say something. It's been a joy. We're going to be leaving here soon and shortly. And I'm hoping that everybody goes out, gets introspection where can they it's, get that? you know what we had a great show today and i just want to thank all my guests studio Woo! audience guests you know god is good i live by the three g's god guidance and goals in that order and i want to give a shout out and say holla 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 holla, holla. go get your book barnes and nobles uh, dot com amazon and look for our uh tour that we're going to be doing with barnes and nobles Hey, let's go yes. see what Gina's doing. Is that all right with you guys? Yes. Who's yes. game? Let's Who's game? Who's game? Gina's you guys want to go get a Slurpee? Let's Who's go. buying? Who's buying? Yes. Who's buying? You buying? Buy. You buying? Right. Let's get I, I hope. Is there anybody out there that has root beer and banana? Please, I want one. <laughs> we'll Haven't find one. It. We'll find one. How about you? Yes. Let's go. Okay. 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 <laughs> Studio audience, are we going to go get a Slurpee? Let's go get a let's Slurpee. Go. Let's go get a Slurpee. I'm game. Slurpee. I threw my roses on my grave and said goodbye. The old me is gone and it can't stay alive. Roses, roses, roses falling from my hand. Six feet under the past is dead. This segment brought to you by Javita Coffee. Are you losing weight drinking coffee? Find out how Javita can change your life. Watch Tim Teeson live Wednesdays at 3 p.m. right here on centralvalleytalk.com and on digital channel 33.2. If you missed the live broadcast, we're on every Wednesday night at 11 p.m. on Comcast channel 200 and digital channel 43.5. You don't want to miss this. Hey, my name's Chris DeVold, the host of Sex Drugs, Chris DeVold. I've been on CentralValleyTalk.com for eight months partying on Tuesday nights, but guess what? The party's moving nights. Now I'm on Friday nights at 8 p.m. Apparently the party was just too much on Tuesday nights. So join me on CentralValleyTalk.com where I promise to bring you one live music act a week. Sex Drugs, Chris DeVold, Friday nights, 8 p.m. on CentralValleyTalk.com. This just in. Tower District houses are selling for as little as $300 per month. If you have a job and decent credit, you can own your own home. If you can come up with a down payment, you can own a home a lot cheaper than you can rent. And your payment will never go up. Also, you could deduct most of your house Central payments.